This is the in-service video for the new steel 462 chainsaw uh, that we just purchased. Uh, we used to, or our other engines have the 461 saw. This is a 462. It does have a couple of differences. You'll notice that it has a muffler guard here to keep insulation and stuff from uh, coming in contact with the muffler. It also has a scrunch holder here mounted to the handle. It also has a larger pull handle, so a gloved hand will fit in it better. Um, and then we will move around to the back of the saw. This new saw has been redesigned, or the, the, the starting uh, function of the saw has been redesigned. Uh, you, you'll remember the old saws had a, uh, a multi-position switch where it's off, on or run, pull the trigger down to a full choke, you pull it until it kicks over, then you move it to half choke, pull it till it starts, and then before it, you know, let it warm up and before it chokes itself out, you would pull the trigger so it's run and then it's idling there by itself. The new saw, it, uh, oh, it also has a, uh, some anti-vibration, but the new saw has a, has a um, fewer positions on the switch, First of all, it's a momentary off, so to turn it off, you just hold it until it dies, and then you, once you release it, it's, it's back in the run position. You don't have to select it like the old saw. The choke on this is an auto-regulating choke, so you set, it, you set it in the same manner that you did the old saw. However, the key difference here is you pull it till it starts. You don't wait till it kicks over, you just pull it till it starts, and then the choke regulates itself you can start it and walk away with it in the choke position and it's gonna deliver the appropriate amount of fuel and not choke itself out. Uh, so you can walk away, come back in five minutes, it's still running, and then when you're ready to go, you're just gonna pull, pull the trigger and, and it's in regular idle mode. Uh, so starting the saws, same uh, other than the key differences I just mentioned there, it's the same procedure. You're gonna engage your uh, chain brake, you're gonna push your de decompression handle, you're gonna set your choke down to there, and then you're going to That is the new steel 462 chainsaw.